Hi folks, another very short one here. This is me looking at a particular job I'm working on at the moment where I'm editing a whole bunch of portraits. Now this can be done as a batch using the plugin uh, version of Retouch for Me. So with the panel, you've got your settings. Um, so I'm on settings at the moment. And so you, like, you've got your on device. So these are the different plugins that you can have. These are the ones I've got turned on here. Okay, so it knows which ones you have and will kind of work with the ones you have. So I want something with this. So I'm going to go to my settings for batch and I'm going to come here to, to batch and I make sure that it's set to PSD here. And I do want it layered so I can go back and uh, re-edit stuff later. So this actually doesn't work from open files. It works from uh, basically folders that you select. So I'm going to come down here to on devices. I'm going to select batch retouching. And I am going to go to my export folder where I have, uh, sorry, uh, date modified. And I'm going to choose this folder here. And it will basically pull all of these images up and start editing them. What we'll do is we may see the whole edit before it jumps onto the next one because it's going to close it down. So it's working through these. Now it works in, the, in its own order. Um, so this allows me to literally just run this batch and go away or do something else inside Lightroom because this is running independently of Lightroom. Now it is creating 16-bit uh, files, so it is creating the maximum possible uh, bit depth that you can have. Uh, you may choose to make them smaller again afterwards, but that's entirely up to you. So it's going to run and do all of those 19 files and I can be off doing something else instead and have my retouch done.